some uh, greetings from Greeley, Colorado. Greeley, Colorado. What's the temperature right now? Well, I think it's about oh, 88 degrees, and they're saying it's going to go north of 95. Oh, boy. Yesterday, they, they broke records on the high end, and they had lows that didn't get below 75 last night. So they're really warm out here. But they say it's a dry heat. I still say it's just heat. It's heat. <laughs> you're uh, The reason why you're out there, Doug. Well, I'm out here on the Western Sugar Cooperative official variety tour to where we go around and look at trials throughout the front range of Colorado. That's where we started here this morning. We started up in Mead. That's uh, just east of I-25 up in Weld County. And those guys there, they uh, they didn't get the water early. And they're actually talking about shutting the water off the 1st of August to mid-August. And that's really going to hurt because these guys usually water right up until September. And uh, you can tell they're a little bit further behind, but you come up north a little bit more to Greeley here. And they've got a, a different water source. And, you know, they've had some rains up in some of the burn areas. And, and they say they're, they're, they're getting their... Uh, all their minerals and, and carbon numbers because some of the water is just black that's running down their, their pipes, and you can see it in the middle of the rows from the furrow irrigation and that. So water's water's key to everything, but a lot better looking crop up here in Greeley, and um, it, it's it's all about the water. Now, but, as far uh, we'll as up, as far as your travels go, other than Greeley, where are you going? Well, we're we're heading up north to Brush in Yuma. And then from there, we're going to uh, Lyman, Nebraska, and end up up in Scotts Bluff, Nebraska tonight. Oh, very interesting. Now, you'll report back as to uh, what you find, right? Yeah, I sure will. I know talking to them, Jonathan and Terry, that, you know, they're they're looking to be a couple tons off. Usually these guys on the front range of Colorado, they, they average 32, 34 tons over the last 10 years, and they're only projecting maybe a crop this year wow doug hey we we appreciate your input uh thanks a lot and again uh uh, let's talk in about a week or so and let's talk about uh, what you found over there all right sounds good you guys have a great day 